This video is brought to you by XR Hammer Gaming. Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, XR Hammer, and as you can clearly see, I would imagine <laughs> by me looking at this giant map, it's really, really, really an intricate map. But yeah, we're playing Dungeon Defenders 2 again. I feel like it's slightly taken over my channel, but I'm having a lot, a lot of fun playing it. So it's all right for a little bit. Don't worry, I'm not neglecting the other games I'm just really enjoying this one at the minute and yeah the next map we're on to is the throne room which is beautiful <laughs> such a good map I really do enjoy playing this I've been farming it quite a lot just because I read up and to get legendary drops this is a really good map for it early on it's a really good stage oh look at that inside the throne room with its defensive traps and royal protection hello the crystal stands a much better chance of survival but first the threat of dragon fall must be dispatched let's go I have got a very good setup for this as well you'll see right let's go straight into the build phase get this and away we go right we need Barricade there, or a blockade. Blockade there. And then we go blockade around here, but that way. And a blockade here. And then we go. Ooh, ooh. One. Come on. Two. And three there. And then, believe it or not, guys, we do exactly the same this side. So we go one. Ooh, come on. Come up There we go. Right, dude. One, two, and three. And then we go up this way. And we block off right in front of this set of armour. And then what we do is we put a ballista this side. Mainly because we get the um, spear throwers and they're really irritating when they're just out of range you know, so yeah that's why I do that and then I'll get a couple of cannons there and I will put one there and one nice and snug next to it we put blockade there and a cannon behind it and now over this way now this lane here is the trickiest for me personally because you're trying to stop everything getting there so what I do is I put the blockade here and then I pack this bit up with my defences but it's really hard to see where the uh, trajectory of the rounds are going to go unless you stand up here so if you are playing this game and you're finding it, like I was, a little bit tricky, then up here is your best bet, in my opinion. And then, again, we um, put the blockade there, right in front of that suit of armour. And you can activate these sets of armour, you just hit them, and they come down, did a load of damage. Which is useful if you are, like me, nowhere near this side of the map half the time. Uh, yeah. So if you see your defences are getting a bit weak, you can quickly send over one of these. I'll show you. I'll demonstrate on that one. Look. Send that over. And kapow! You know, extra damage. It's always good. It's always nice to have a bit more extra damage. Right, and then we'll put Cannonball Tower there. If we swap over to the Monk, I'm pretty sure I can get... I might be able to get two all of it in. I don't see why not. Get an aura there. And an aura there. And I might... I might even treat myself and put another cannon down. <laughs> Come on, I can get it in there. Yes, look at that. Beautiful. And let's go. See guys, the key is preparation. Always has been, always will be. Look at this. <laughs> Everything just gets melted. Wow, this new sword I found. 
It doesn't attack as quick as my other one, but it deals more damage. And, yeah, it just melts everything. Right, let's go up that way, as they are needing assistance. Look at that. Beautifully done. Beautifully done. Right, let's give this lane a little bit of a hand. But, oh, well done. That was like right. properly misfire that one. Oh, that was unnecessary. Right, let's go this way again. See, guys, it's always this lane. Always. Just this one lane here. I always seem to have trouble with it. I don't know why. I think maybe a little little bit more experimenting's in order. Just to uh, get the placements, you know, really, really, really nice. And has that done it? Yes, that has done the wave. So now we'll go back up here. We'll open this chest. Get all the mana, take this stuff. Now. What I normally do is I'll upgrade these here and these two. Then typically I can leave this this side alone, you know, which is ideally what you want. Then I upgrade those three, upgrade three of them because normally I don't have four there. Wow, that was a massive fail. <laughs> and then I'll go one, two. And free, and I do believe it's like a little mini boss. Yeah, there he is. Right, so that one destroyed nothing, and then I believe there's another one. He's definitely not there, is he up here? No, but there are some ogres and a little T Rexy looking thing. that up quick, come down here, wipe these lot out, wonderful, beautifully handled that wave, and then we can get up here, take out those, take out these, beautiful, look at that, honestly guys, the key is preparation, I cannot stress that enough. Ooh. That was value. Value for mana. Alright, a little bit of assistance there. Nothing too major on that side, really. I don't feel like I need to. Pick that up while I'm over it. Wow. Yeah, there we go. That's another wave done. We'll open this chest this time. I don't think it matters which chest you open. You know, on your rounds, I just do whichever one I really want to, if I'm honest with you. Whichever one's closest, typically. Right, can I get... I think if I get another cannon down like that, I'll double upgrade that one and that one. They are now all upgraded. Let's come down here. Which one was it? This little one here. That one's upgraded. Let's upgrade the auras. Even better. And then... We'll upgrade this one. Just because, why not? And away we go. Is it this side this time? Yep. <laughs> I did tell you. I've been um, farming this one for quite a while. Though. He'll blow up. Give me his nice loot. And there's another one. Where is he? I can't ever remember where he is. Ah, he's up there. There we go. Come here. Yes. Beautiful. And seven. Oh, I missed. 
Ah. Right. The little kamikaze dudes will just run at your defences and, you know, do what they're designed to do, which is just blow up and wreck your defences, typically. Oh, wow. Right, I have got a big wave coming up on that left hand side. So I might have to go and give a little bit of assistance. Wow. I say a little bit, because that's tiny. Nicely done. Once again. <laughs> Up this way. Let's collect this stuff. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Right, open that one. Yeah, 30 seconds until the boss. And the boss spawns in down here. So what I'll do is I'll go. Huh? Yeah, one, two, three, four, one, two. Three, because I don't know which side he's going to come on. I should come over here, collect all of this stuff. And then go, and we shall take on the boss, whichever side. I right, spawn in this side. Very nice, so we'll use this. Oh wow, he's not even out of his safe zone, I don't think. Oh dear, you suck, dude. Come in range of my cannons, just make it a tiny bit easier for me. There we go. And he's down, look at that. Beautifully done. Right, now. Ooh, it's a uh, mythical chest, but hopefully, hopefully, it could upgrade to a legendary. That'd be lovely. Or not. I mean, just give me... Alright, we've got some more of these. A Ramster Slapper. Hmm. I had one of those for quite a while. Alright, what did... That looks like a unicorn. Ha <laughs> ha, that's cute. But yeah, that is a nice mythical totem there. Hence, why I have been... Farming this level, you know, sort of self explanatory when you get near enough guaranteed mythicals. I think I've had a blue maybe twice, and I have played it a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of times. But yeah, if you're enjoying this little mini series I've got going on with Dungeon Defenders going through, you know, all the levels, then leave a like and a comment down below. And yeah. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. The Peace out, guys. Castle, quickly find their way through the streets of Dragonfall to the sewer's entrance. The sounds of the enemy echo all around them. It is clear that the sewers are no safer than the roads above. It would also appear that the sewers hold great mysteries yet to be discovered.